What's poppin' YouTube? Man King D here. Quick channel update. Alright, first let me get into it. Fable 3 comes out tonight. Tonight? What? Tonight already? Goddamn. That was fast. Alright, listen. I'm a big fan of Fable. I love Fable 1. I was a little disappointed with Fable 2. They kind of went more with the action with the action side, the action pace type shit, or you want to call it, I mean, they kind of took away some, a lot of RP elements that made, but I mean, it's whatever, I mean, I still liked it, I still thought it was fun, I still thought it was good, the only thing I do want to see with Fable 3, is please make it longer, Fable 1 and Fable 2 was short, and once it was short, they were very fucking short, please make it longer, that's all I'm asking for, I'm, I mean, I don't think it was come out with downloadable content make the games longer you know that what you do for meanwhile but it's like personally i mean sometimes i don't really like buying downloadable content like that especially games i mean of course i mean i ain't do it with people too because i didn't fucking do it but i mean of course this time around if you do come out with downloadable content i will be buying it but come on man make my game longer that's all i want make it long for me so that's, that's all i'm asking for Come on, Lion here. Make that game fuck up long enough where I can fucking just love that game to death. Alright, anyway. Moving on. <sighs> Fist of the North Star demo. You hear the silence? Yeah. If you have not seen me play that demo, don't. Do not waste your time on that demo. It is a gig or download that demo. It takes up a gig worker space on your hard drive. It's not even fucking worth it. Let me tell you something. That demo actually either gives either A, the animation no credit, or B, that game, or that game, or C, that game is going to be fucking trash when it come out, alright? Either it gives the game no justice, or it's the game going to be garbage. Like, I why I say that because the every time I play an NBA 2K demo, they're always trash. The demos always hurt the game, in, in my opinion. Like the demo always make me not want to buy the game. All right, now now me saying that, let's talk about it real quick. Personally, personally wise, I have played this demo twice, and then I still do not like it. And I'm just going to say that. I feel like it's a demo. Would I buy this game when it comes out um, next Tuesday? No. Because uh, most likely I'll probably get Dragon Ball Z over that anyway. But it's the fact, it's the fact of the matter is, I feel like, I don't know. It's just, I, I'm a big fan. I'm a huge fan of the beat em ups or hack and slash. I, I'm, I don't, you can't really call it a hack and slash, more a beat em up. I'm more a fan of beat em up, like, like Shoot Your Raid, old school games like that back in the day. And this one is is it just hurts it's just hurting that game so much that it's not even fucking funny. Like but like I really had high hopes for that demo because when I seen the um the trailer for it on YouTube, I was like never seen the animation, but I was like shit with a game like that. Fucking nonsense, violent, old school beat 'em up style. I was happy until I played the demo. Until I played the motherfucker demo, that demo fucking really wanna hurt me. You should see me. Like I think that shit brought a tear to my eye. Both my, I think I already cry because that's how bad that demo hurt my motherfucking feelings. Oh, anyway, moving on from North Star demo, North Star period. All right, for all you Halo fans out there, all you Halo fanatics, the wait is officially about to be over, and officially, officially a month from now. They are coming up with brand new Halo maps. Alright, it's gonna be called Halo Noble Maps. They will be they will they'll they run you officially ten hours for all those maps, but here's the downside. Alright. There may be ten hours for all those maps, but now you're only getting three maps, three brand new maps, and that's it. That's all you're getting. There's three maps. Alright. Um, technically, I guess that's okay, I guess. Uh like because when you look at games like Modern Warfare 2, when they gave you three brand new maps and two old maps for 15, you're kind of looking like, what the fuck? I don't know if Microsoft's trying to play somebody, or I don't know what it is lately, but they're trying to rip off people on maps that I don't 
appreciate. Alright. Now, I ain't not buy no Call of Duty map, so I ain't give a shit because my first thing was I'm not playing three brand new maps and two old maps for 15. I like, I'll do it for 10, but not 15. Now, three new maps, I might, pay, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I might, I will pass on this. Only because I'm gonna say I'm, I'm gonna pass on this for right now is because the simple fucking fact I will be still playing Black Ops. Like, seriously, like, when Black Ops drop on a knife, I will have no regulation on what the fuck Halo is. I'll be like, what the fuck is Halo? Like, I don't know what Halo is. Like, I don't know Black Ops. I mean, technically, I would think they would put it out either sometime this month or, like, the week before Black Ops come out. So you can at least have people still playing your Halo game. I, I understand the Halo fanatics, the Halo fans, or the, 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 the crazy Halo fans out there will automatically be playing Halo. And so the map drop on the 30th of November, like, when they're coming out, that they will be buying it. Buying the uh the noble mad packs for for uh ten bucks, but it won't be me. Like I'm sorry. I like I will but I won't buy the maps because not out of tip, they're gonna go on sale on the dashboard for like five dollars and I'll probably buy it then because three maps for ten dollars in my opinion, that's pushing it. That that's pushing to the point where it's like ridiculous. Alright. So me personally, I'm gonna say I'm gonna pass on it. I'm gonna pass on it, the uh, the mad pack for right now, but but yeah. But so all you Halo fans, you can look forward to the new maps because I've been saying that Halo need new maps since the second week that game has came out. That's the reason why I started playing. I got tired of playing the same old fucking maps. So and now the new maps coming out, you know, a lot of people have can look forward to to get on that and dominating. Also, to, on the trailer I seen for the new maps, I see that they have a brand new helmet for 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 Halo. I don't know if you gotta get higher higher rank in Halo. I haven't played Halo in a while. And, uh, I don't know. I don't know if you get higher rank in Halo. I don't know what the deal is. But the helmet I seen is like your your um your glass. I don't know what you wanna call it or the visor for the helmet. It's like skull shaped. It shit. You know, that shit looks sick when I seen it. That was a sick looking helmet. I don't know what you gotta do to get that helmet, but shit, with that helmet like that, I bet money that's gonna be the next, the next uh, recon helmet that everybody gonna be going for. So when I said that helmet was sick, yo, the recon helmet ain't got shit on that helmet that I seen on the fucking trailer for the new maps. So so y'all can go try to find that trailer on YouTube. I did not go to YouTube actually. I'm gonna tell you about where I seen the trailer at. I seen the trailer for the um, the normal map packs. I seen the trailer. At GameInformer.com, so y'all can go over there and go check out the uh, the Halo trailer. Um, and that's about it, pretty much, with the uh, channel update. Um, I'm gonna talk about some games that was, you know, uh, you know, Fable coming out. I'm gonna talk about the the North Star demo. I definitely want to talk about the Halo maps. Um, I probably not be doing no gameplay videos at all. I probably might do a little bit of Fable when I do get it at midnight tonight. I might be doing a little bit of that. Uh, I will not be doing no no gears or Halo gameplay in the mean matches in a while because I will be fucking playing fucking Fable and I probably won't be playing any fucking game other than Fable until fucking Black Ops come out. So pretty much next time I actually do some real gameplay for this or anything, nine out of ten, that's not even nine, probably seven out of ten. I probably wait. Excuse me. I probably wait until. Black Ops come out, but I highly see that happening. So, um, give me like probably like four days with Fable, and then I probably give you a match, probably a Call of Duty to say my farewell to that. And by um, well, but not farewell to Call of Duty, farewell to Modern Warfare until Black Ops come out. And um, I still will be doing my Gears matches. Um, I probably do my Gears matches this probably uh Saturday. This, this I'm gonna say Saturday for my Gears matches because. I gotta get um, cause I'm, I'm I don't really feel like playing that by myself. I really want a team, so I'm gonna try to get a team together by Saturday, so I can give me uh some matches. Um, of course I still will be doing my throwback Wednesdays, cause you know I I'm telling you I'm a I like throwback games. So um, so this is Kenny coming at y'all with a channel update, and I will be having some videos up there of the midnight release at my GameStop and unboxing on Fable. So keep that in mind. Alright, so this candy coming at y'all. One. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. You! I'm sorry to do it.